You are listening to Christian Audio's production of Being a Dad Who Leads by John MacArthur. This book is read by Maurice England. This audio recording was produced in 2014 by Christian Audio, which owns the copyright. No portion of this recording may be reproduced for any reason without prior written consent from Christian Audio. This edition issued by contractual arrangement with Harvest House Publishers. Originally published in English as Being a Dad Who Leads, copyright 2014 by John MacArthur. All rights reserved. Please visit ChristianAudio.com, Facebook.com forward slash Christian Audio, or Twitter.com forward slash Christian Audio to offer your impressions of this work and to explore additional titles. Introduction no duty in my life is more important or more sacred than my role as a husband and father. That is where my true character is most accurately seen, and it is the best single gauge of my overall success or failure as a leader and role model. Everything else I do as a pastor, educator, author, or ministry leader would be severely compromised if I failed to lead my own family properly. In fact, this is one of the key tests of whether any man is fit to lead the church. Because if a man does not know how to manage his own household, how will he take care of the church of God? 1 Timothy chapter 3, verse 5. Conversely, if a man cultivates grace, godliness, and the mind of Christ in his home life, the fruit of the Spirit will naturally be seen in abundance throughout every facet of his life his performance in the workplace, all his relationships, and his conduct in the world. Furthermore, because home is where a person's true temperament is most clearly on display, no one knows the real character of a man better than his own children. They see with a keener clarity than most dads realize. If a man's public persona is merely a hypocritical veneer that disappears in the privacy of the home, the kids will be the first to see that. Indeed, it's hard to imagine anything more destructive to a child's moral and spiritual development. An ungodly, hypocritical, or indifferent dad is not only a constant full-time negative role model. His influence also breeds cynicism, unbelief, discouragement, resentment, and a whole new generation of hypocrisy in his own children. Thus the iniquity of the fathers is visited on the children to the third and the fourth generations. Numbers chapter 14, verse 8. Sample complete. Ready to continue?